Morning guys, Ian at Paint Tip. We are back on site on this staircase that we did probably about, I don't know, four, maybe six months ago. And as you can see, we've had a lot of shrinkage on the wood. The problem we've got is Carpenter, really nice fella, obviously very, very talented. However, came in and did the prep. But what he did was he used the sander too aggressively and has actually cut dips. So we've had to two pack, this one's probably a better one, to refill the dips. Whereas if we'd have actually just been allowed to do the, the kind of sanding and prep ourselves, we wouldn't have had to do as much filling as what we have. You can see quite clearly, we've had to be quite excessive. Hi guys, Ian at Paint Tape. As you can see, we are back on the job, which is the staircase. We've done all the touch-ups, and we've done the majority of it, obviously by a brush, because it touches in quite nice. However, the handrail, we've tried using the style monitors, but it just doesn't leave the same luster, and the client obviously wants the spray finish, because that's what she's paid for. So we've masked off what we need to mask off, and prepped the handrail again, just giving it a 240 for the car park. And as you can see with the paper, the reason for that is we just don't want any dust, any overspray hitting anywhere where we don't want overspray. So I'm going to come around to the corner, then what I'm going to do is gently remove the paper, make sure we've got no dust, and then carry on with the next section. So let's, let's do it. Hi guys, Ian at Paint Tech. As you can see, we've just finished the staircase. We've just come back and just done a little bit of filling and a little touch up. We've just done a little bit of cracking where some of the construction is. Uh, the carpenter's done an incredible job. He's a really, really nice guy, very talented. We've spread this in a satin finish and as you can see, it looks really, really good. The client's well pleased. She's just got organized the, car the carpet. It's not the easiest project to do. Um, the house was completely finished, so we had to wrap the walls, the floors and other areas, literally no carpet. Systems are probably the, the main part of spraying staircases like this, because you're going to generate a lot of water spray. No matter what you do, spraying the spindles, etc., it's going to come through one side, it's going to land on the treads, so you've got to deal with the treads in a different way. You're going to spray the top, it's going to land obviously on the on the handrails and the cappings, so again, you've got to deal with that. We had to spray this final coat in about five to six different sections. We'd spray a section, stop, then what we'd do is we would rewrap another section, stop, rewrap, and equally, you're trying to do it in such a way that you don't actually generate dust. So when you start to unwrap everything, ready for the next section, coming downstairs, you're having to do it in a very clever system so that you don't generate dust on areas that are already wet. Um, just spoken to the client, she's very, very impressed, very pleased. Nobody else we found that we've come across can actually deliver uh, a spray finish to this level within a house that's already finished. So we're pretty chuffed. It looks great, we're very pleased the client's over the moon. So happy days.